I'm Archbishop Dr. James Opia Nyango, uh, the chairman of Sierra County Church Leaders Forum. We thank God for answering our prayers by talking to the Azimio Coalition to call off this week's demonstrations as a sign of peace building. We, the CIA County Church Leaders Forum, are concerned with the recent happenings in the nation and wish to state the following. Number one, we are concerned about the killing of the innocent and brutal use of the firearms on the unarmed citizens. Number two, uh, we are concerned about the withdrawal of security on key leaders and acts of intolerance. Uh, oh, number three, we are concerned about politicians coming into some churches and making political statements on church platforms. And uh, number four, uh, we are advising the police to desist from using too much force in torture and detention. Number five, we advise the demonstrators to do so peacefully without blocking and burning roads. Uh, number six, we appeal to the government to consider pulling out the finance bill and act that is making the life of the people uh, quite unbearable. Number seven, we appeal, we are making a humble appeal to His Excellency uh, President William uh, Samoe Ruto and the former Prime Minister, Right Honorable Raila Odinga, to find time and meet for a lasting solution. And this is going to help us when these two men meet and chat, God must bring the solution. It is our humble request that they do this for to save our country from where it is now. Uh, the last one that we have as a, an appeal is politicians to desist from making inflammatory statements, both the high-ranking politicians from government and the opposition, as this incites the people and cause an unnecessary anger among the citizens. You see, uh, that oh, politicians should be sober and desist from making inflammatory statements uh, to help our people not to get more angry and uh, act uh, lawlessly because of the acts, the utterances of the politicians. The Bible says in Proverbs chapter 15 verse 1 that a soft answer turns away wrath but a harsh word stirs up anger. Therefore, we must desist or our leaders, top leaders, should desist from making inflammatory statements and uh, desist from uh, 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 statements of, uh, to make others angry, uh, like uh, uh, insulting, insulting others. Because when we do the insult of other people, then we are going uh, not to have uh, peace. Because the Bible has said that a soft answer turns away wrath. And therefore, we must be ready to be soft to each and everyone. This is our total appeal. Yes. That all leaders 
irrespective of their status. Yes. They should see the sense yes. of talking peace, yes. talk nicely, not insulting each other. And again, we said that we want to respect God also by not going into churches and making political statements there. Even on the of, of funerals that are officiated by the church, <coughs> it is quite a disrespect to the church when politicians go to the funerals and the funerals are being headed by bishops and pastors and they uh, start politics there. They start making statements that can bring chaos to the citizens. It is our uh, uh, concern that when the politicians desist from doing this, we see peace coming into this our country. So that the funerals should be just for the burial of the disease and the church ministers uh, doing their work of, of officiating the funeral mm -hmm. and then that's the end of everything. Yes. We are appealing to our people, to especially the politicians, to, uh, to desist from uh, what I have already said, like inflammatory uh, statements and in hurling abusive words against each other. Because when you abuse another politician, this is going to cause anger to people who believe in him. And this is what is going on in this our country. So it is our humble request to the high-ranking politicians and high-ranking opposition uh, politicians uh, to make sure that they bring peace into this country by talking peace. This is our uh, stand as the clergy in Siaya County, that we need peace in this our country. Peace is more than anyone. We need peace more than any an individual. An individual can be a president, can be a, uh, an opposition leader, he can be anything. But without peace, we may not benefit from them. Kenya is what it is because we have had maintained this peace for the last 60 years. And we are appealing to our members, appealing to the politicians, not to take things for granted, yes. but to make sure that we maintain this our peace. Not what you want, but what Kenyans want. Amen. And what Kenyans want is peace. Amen. May God bless you. We as the church leaders, it is very prudent that uh, we don't allow our pulpits to be used by politicians to talk things that are dividing the nation. Uh, we have agreed among us that uh, in Siaya County especially, if politicians want to talk, they can make their own platforms, mm. but not come to our, our churches and start inciting people. So we have also been concerned about the police brutality. The police are so brutal. We have seen them really beating people in estates. Somebody who did not even go to demonstrate is looked for in his home and he's beaten. A case in point is that some, uh, some people were even sick in uh, Nyalenda Kisumu in their houses. And you find that the police have gone there to beat somebody who is sick in, in a sick bed. That is not good. And, and even there have been killings which are very unnecessary. Uh, but at the same time, we also want to appeal to the demonstrators that please do it with the decorum. Let there be control. We have seen tall people having collecting money on the roads. That is not right in demonstration. Mm. So it's good for them also to take care of our roads because roads are serving all of us. Mm. So let them not light fires beside the roads and let them not block the roads because some people may be going to the hospital. His Excellency uh, President uh, William Ruto Oh, he should make a, a move. He should make a move. He should make a move towards uh, Honorable, right Honorable Raila Odinga, or vice versa. Even Raila Odinga should make a move towards William Ruto so that people can talk. Mm. Because they are the ones that are our examples. They are the symbol of unity and peace in this country. So we kindly request them to find time and find each other. It's not the first time such a thing happens in this country or even in the world. The, the places where people have 
enjoyed peace are the places where people, the leaders have agreed to talk. And so we just want to, to request them kindly as the clergy of Siaya County to please let them find each other and find time for each other. And I know that they can talk without the people who are surrounding them. Yeah, there are some people who are really surrounding them who do not want to talk because maybe they fear they will lose something. But what they are going to lose is not as important as what Kenya is going to gain. Thank you. Thank you. Uh,